Iraqi resistance fighters have launched a drone strike against a strategic target in the southernmost part of the 1948 Israeli-occupied territories in response to the Tel Aviv regime's unrelenting onslaught against Palestinians in Gaza. The Islamic resistance in Iraq, an umbrella group of anti-terror fighters, made the announcement in a statement published on its Telegram channel on Monday morning. It noted that the attack on the vital site in the port of Eilat was carried out with a number of kamikaze drones. The coalition said the retaliatory operation was carried out in continuation of the struggle against the occupying Israeli regime, in support of Palestinians in Gaza, and in retaliation for the massacres that the usurping Zionist entity is perpetrating against women, children, and elderly people in the besieged territory. The group further emphasized that it will continue to target and destroy important sites across the occupied lands. The development comes a day after the Islamic resistance in Iraq claimed responsibility for an attack on a vital facility in the port of Ailat. The Islamic resistance in Iraq has been staging many such attacks on Israeli targets since the occupying regime launched a genocidal war on Gaza in early October. Israel launched the war on Gaza on October 7th after Palestinian resistance groups carried out a surprise retaliatory operation into the occupied territories. Concomitantly with the war, the regime has been enforcing a near total siege on the coastal territory which has reduced the flow of foodstuffs, medicine, electricity and water into the Palestinian territory into a trickle. The Israeli war has killed at least 35,456 Gazans most of them women, children and adolescents. Another 79,476 Palestinians have sustained injuries as well. Report by Press TV's website.